All right. So with a triangular prism, you're going to want to keep track of this a similar way, except for there is not going to be three pairs of faces anymore. There are going to be only one pair of faces. The only pair, the only faces that match are the triangles. These are going to match. Every other face is going to be unique in this case. Sometimes they'll be the same, but in this case, they're going to be unique. Every other face is unique. And how many other faces are there? Well, there are going to be these two faces, which are triangles. And, um, and then I'm going to have one, two, three, because it goes all the way around. So the pair of faces and then three other faces. So however you want to keep track of it, that's up to you. I like to say top, bottom, left, right, front, back again. And that's just because I'm used to doing it that way. And so I like to do it that way. So I'm going to start with left, right. It's difficult to see on these drawings what's left, right. I'm going to make the triangles left, right. So how do I find the area of a triangle? These, these are the pairs. This is the pairs, the triangles. I have to go base times height divided by two. That's how to find the area of a triangle. So I have six times eight, which is 48 divided by two. That will be 24. But don't forget there are two faces. So I'm going to multiply by two again. And what's that gonna get? 48. So instead of dividing by two and multiplying by two, sometimes you can cancel this step and just remember that it's 48. But it's, good, it's a good habit to get into the habit of doing the calculation. So I have for my left and right, both of those yellow, I have the answer 48. That's going to be my yellow. All right, so now I'm going to do each face individually. I'm going to, to call this one top. And I'm going to call it green. I'm going to color it green as my top. And what's the top face? 3 times 10, 30. There's my top. Let's go ahead and do, so we got left, right, top. Let's go do bottom, since we did top. Let's do bottom, eight times three. Eight times three, 24. That's my bottom down here. And the final side here, we could call this back, I suppose. Anything you want to call it. You don't have to write the whole word either. You could write anything you want, call it blue side, whatever. This is six times, what's this up here? Three, because that is three. Six times three is 18. So I like to color code them. I'm very patient. I know some of you are gonna rush through it. And when you rush, you're tempted or you're more likely to make a mistake. So now that I have my left rights, my yellows, uh, my top, my bottom, and my 18, once again, I have three faces and one pair of faces. So this was the pair and three faces. I add all of those up to get the final response. And it should be 120, which is what my answer should be. Centimeters squared.